The next set of keyboard shortcuts I would like to define will be related to working with the search. But before that, let's define a couple of additional keyboard shortcuts that will allow us to focus on the file explorer. Usually to focus on the file explorer, I'm using combination command H. And let's also define a couple of conditions that define when this keyboard shortcut will take effect. There are actually lots of such conditions, and they are highly dependent on the specific keyboard shortcuts, so I'm not going to explain in detail what each of those conditions actually means, but instead we'll just use those conditions that work, in my case, for these specific keyboard shortcuts. So after saving the file and pressing Command H, as we can see, File Explorer receives focus. But unfortunately, if we will press Command H again, the focus will not be shifted back to the editor. To make it work, we have to define additional keyboard shortcuts. So here we are using same keyboard shortcut Command H, but in this case, we need the command called Focus Active Editor Group. And we're going to make this keyboard shortcut take effect only when our editor is not currently focus, which will be ensured by using the following condition. So right now, if my focus is currently located on the file and I'll press Command H, the focus is shifted to the file explorer. And if I am currently focus on the file explorer, pressing Command H will shift focus to the file itself. The next keyboard shortcut that we are going to register will allow us to focus on the search field. Default keyboard shortcut to open up panel with the search is Command Shift F. So when pressing Command H, I want that search field to receive focus. Let's do so. Let's define keyboard shortcuts. Also register same key combination Command H. In this case, the command name will be View Search Focus. And the following condition, which will ensure that this keyboard shortcut will only take effect when the global search panel is open and the search field does not yet have focus. And now as we can see after pressing Command H, search field receives focus. So this will only work if global search panel is opened, otherwise Command H will shift focus to the file explorer. The next keyboard shortcut, which will be Command K, is going to allow us to move the focus to the next input box. So firstly, I'm going to define this keyboard shortcut, and after that, we'll demonstrate how it works. So now, if we're gonna shift focus to the search field, and we'll press Command K, as we can see, the focus shifts down to the next input box. And now to move in opposite direction, I'm going to register another keyboard shortcuts. I'm using Command L to move up. So I'm pretty much going to register almost the same entry in here. And we'll just change shortcut on Command L. The command itself will be called previous input box. And also we'll tweak this when condition a bit. Again, these when conditions tend to be very specific, so I'm not going to explain them in detail. Anyway, the whole configuration file will be available in the GitHub repository, and the link to the repository will be in the video description. So now we can use Command K to move to the next input box, and Command L to move to the previous input box, like so. Next shortcut will be responsible for collapsing all search results in this panel. So let's switch over back to keybindings.json and add another entry in this object of configurations. So to collapse all search results, I'm using combination alt command semicolon. In this case, the command name will be collapse search results. And there is no need for when condition, so let's remove key when and try it out. If I'm gonna press Alt Command semicolon, as we can see, all search results were collapsed. Next, I'm gonna register 
keyboard shortcut for an opposite action, which is expanding all search results. And for this I'm using the following keys, Alt, Command and quotation mark. And after saving the file, when pressing Alt, Command, quotation mark, all search results were expanded, and when pressing Alt, Command, semicolon, they are collapsed. Let's move on. Sometimes I need to quickly focus on, on this search panel with all search results to be able to navigate between those results by using arrow keys up and down. So in order to make this panel receive focus, I'm using the following keyboard shortcut. Alt, Command, Zero. The common name will be Focus Searcher List. So after pressing Alt, Command, Zero, search panel with results receives focus, and I can navigate between these results by using arrow keys. But there is a problem. I cannot get focus back to the editor area, because currently I'm pressing Command H, which is keyboard shortcuts we have registered previously to move the focus back to the editor area. Nothing actually happens. This has to do with an order of registration of some of these keyboard shortcuts. Because those keyboard shortcuts that are defined later override keyboard shortcuts defined earlier. So to be able to shift focus back to the editor while having the focus on the search results, I'm going to take the following configuration and place it right after the next one. So now I can easily switch the focus back to the editor while having the focus on the search panel. As we can see this time it worked. At this point we're finishing this lesson, let's continue adding keyboard shortcuts in the next one.